Hi guys, welcome back to another reaction video. Today we have Joey, and he's doing a Rocky Horror makeover with Victoria Justice. This isn't my normal reaction video, but I wanted to check it out because I know the live Rocky Horror Picture Show is coming out soon. Victoria Justice is going to be in it, and it looks amazing. I can't wait for it. So let's just check out this video and see what it's all about. Is this a normal thing to do, lining eyebrows? Oh yeah, totally. Oh! <laughs> ah, good day everyone and welcome to today's video here with Victoria Justice. Hello! I'm so excited Hi. you're here! I'm so excited you're here! Oh, yay! <laughs> so girl, you have a movie coming out. I do, the Rocky Horror Picture Show, Let's Do the Time Warp again. <gasps> yay! It's, it's so much fun um, and we're really paying homage to the movie okay. because the fans have kind of kept the Rocky Horror Picture Show going for over 40 years now yeah. and it's really like an That's interactive cool. experience because there are fan call outs if you ever go to a midnight showing which you should definitely do I've never I been I want to it's so much never been want to though but it yeah looks so I'm, much. I'm so proud so of the movie fun. I think it came turned out so beautifully the music is great it's so much fun it's such a campy crazy colorful wacky world and the cast is amazing I, I know remember. all the names that are attached it's so freaking cool yeah it was so much fun so guys make sure you tune in October 20th but today we are going to be doing a little bit of a transformation for me, yes. so you're gonna be making me into Dr. Frankenfurter. I'm so excited. I am too, but <laughs> to be <laughs> honest, like when I watched the original one, I was terrified. He was so really? scary, right? A little. Bit. He's definitely like different and intimidating. The look is pretty out there. Yeah. It's like dark, very much so, very scary, intense. But I'm super excited. Now watching it as an adult, I'm like, oh my god, this is everything. I yeah. can't wait. Yeah, Tim Curry so. is fabulous, and Tim Curry is also in our remake. I saw that. Yeah, he's playing the narrator, so that's, it was really cool to have That's him. so crazy to have an original cast member be in a remake 40 years later. Crazy. Yeah, um, but anyways, let's get on to the transformation. I'm so excited. Let's do it. Woo! By the way, we're not going for the Laverne look because she was extremely glammed out. Yes, um, that's a little bit more complicated too. <laughs> we're going with the more original. Yeah. Oh. You have great eyebrows, by the way. Oh my god, thank you. Now, you're going to line... Line the eyebrows. Oh, I just broke <laughs> oh, no. Is this a normal thing to do, lining eyebrows? Oh yeah, totally. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's your secret beauty trick. <laughs> Wait, isn't there a saying it's like, my eyebrows are sisters, not twins? Don't people say that? Some... I've never heard of that. Really? I think they say that with boobs. Oh. Boobs <laughs> too, okay. <laughs> what was your favorite scene to shoot? Ooh, um... Was everything... Probably... What were you was everything like exact from like the movie, like all the same like type of scenes, or was there new yeah, stuff? Yeah, like the script is exactly the same. Okay, cool. So all the scenes are the same, all the dialogue's pretty much the same, but there are a lot of new things as well, like new costumes and new choreography. The sets are obviously different. Um, but my favorite scene to film would probably be um, when Laverne is singing Don't Dream It, Be It, and it's we all jump into this pool together in our like yeah. old like that's like at the clothes. end right yeah and it's like basically this very like sensual moment in the pool and we're all like kind of swirling around each other and you it's all this very free love vibe yeah it was the pool actually it was supposed to be heated Kenny <gasps> Ortega was like oh no yeah he told us the day before he was like it's gonna be yeah we're we're heating the pool to 90 degrees you guys are gonna, gonna feel great and you're like awesome we get to the pool and it definitely was not 90 degrees <laughs> it felt like it was. 70 degrees, so oh it was so God. cold, but we had so much fun. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna line the inside of your heart really quick. How long have you been acting for? Um, I started acting when I was eight, I guess. I did my first part. Wow. Oh eight. my God. Yeah. Look like at you, you child star oval team. I know. That's crazy. All right, now it's time to really beat the face. Uh oh. We're going and make you a little paler. Yeah. Who doesn't want to be nice and pale? <laughs> right. <laughs> Wait. So, have you always lived in LA? Uh, no, I was born in Hollywood, Florida. Oh my god! The other the Hollywood. Other Hollywood. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even know that existed in Hollywood, Florida. Yeah. Or did you always know you wanted to be an actress? Um, when I was like eight, I was watching TV and I saw a kid around my age in a commercial and so I like had this crazy idea in my head. I was like, I think I could do that. And so like I called my mom in the room and I was like, Mom, I really want to do that. How do, how do oh I do god. it? And 
so yeah, I just kind of started doing child modeling there and I did like over 30 commercials and yeah, so I just kind of started doing it. I always love performing and singing, I don't know much dancing, about makeup, jazz, what I've learned so. about makeup Wait, so from watching would, Superfruit and Lipstick have, Nick. Yeah, what is is that show Victoria yeah. should be Yeah, I went to my first midnight show when I was 15. As opposed to with, um, two of my really saying, close friends who I haven't seen in a while, unfortunately, but Josh Hutcherson. Oh, casual. Yeah. And uh, Avin Jovia, who was on Victorious with me. Oh my god. Yeah, we got with our moms as well. <laughs> Alright, you're 15. <laughs> yeah, but it was really cool. We all like dressed up. I was wearing fishnets. And... Wait, who did you dress up as? I didn't really dress up as a specific oh, okay. character. I kind of just, just was like a more saucy version of my 15 year old self. Oh my gosh. That's so, so yeah. Crazy. And now you're great. in the show. That's amazing. I know. Our it's, movie. it's really crazy. Yeah, when I found out that they were going to be remaking it, I kind of internally freaked out. I told my agent, I was like, you have to get me on an audition. Like, I have to be a part of this somehow. I don't care how, but I yeah. Okay, so I know that so Rocky Horror like, Picture Show and like all those other ones, like Grease, Sound and Music, such a baby. I'm a Pisces, The Wiz. So I'm very sensitive and yeah. All my agents were on the phone. They say and, they're live. You know, like when they're all on the phone, it's like really things are really But I was always yeah. wondering. And whether or not um, they oh my filmed God, that it. Is yeah. so cool. um, but everybody was singing like live still. Something and then getting to um, play, she's like, kind of making me think that that's yeah. the case. That they, like they still film it ahead of time, I know, but it's, everybody it's is insane. singing live. So, to be able to yeah. sing Touch Me. Yeah! It was, it was oh just my God. Yeah. yeah, and if you fall asleep during a midnight showing, Everyone throws like toilet paper at you. Mom fell asleep, or someone fell asleep, because I, I remember the toilet paper thing happening. But yeah, and also because I was a virgin, because I'd never been to a Rocky or Picture Show yeah. and I'd shown before, um, the people at the theater knew that, and so they got red lipstick and wrote like a big V on my forehead. <laughs> oh my god. And they drew a, uh, a very phallic object on my other friend's cheek. Oh my god. Um, so you have like a whole history with this movie. I do. It can get pretty naughty at times, but the movie isn't, you know, it's more of like, it's kind of more of like leaving things up to your own imagination. And so yeah. It's very, but it definitely has its sexy moments for sure. When was the first time we met? <gasps> was it when we went to church? I yes. think that, we've been to church together, guys. I like it. Yes. I like it. That is oh, some yeah. red. I can't even see. I don't yeah. even have a mirror or anything. Ooh, this is fun. I'm gonna do your makeup oh. every day. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's your favorite Halloween costume from when you were a kid? You know, I used to always be a vampire. And that's because this one lady, when I went trick or treating, she gave me a whole pack of Bubblicious. And she said the reason why she gave it to me was because I was a vampire and my teeth needed stuff to chew on. And it's because of that I literally did a vampire look like five years in a row. Really? Because you wanted more Bubblicious or because? Yeah, I wanted that gum. It was like, normally you get like one piece of candy, you don't get a whole pack of gum. Yeah, I was so excited. The final step, ladies and gentlemen, Going to apply red some gloss. gloss. Red gloss. Yes. Queen oh. Slay. Perfect. Am I done? You're done. Oh, yay. Okay, so now it is time to get in the outfit and have the final reveal. So let's do it. Ladies and gentlemen, the moment that you have all been waiting for, please welcome Joey Graceffa as the one and the only Dr. Frankenfurter. Oh, hello. What? Here I am! Oh my god! You look absolutely incredible. I feel amazing. <laughs> you did an amazing job. I am Thank so you. obsessed with my look. <laughs> I feel fabulous. Where's his wig? You need to wig. Just like show them the whole thing. Let's show them the full look. Okay, yes. let's do it. Um, can you just cinch me up a little bit? Yeah. Okay. Alright, suck in, Joey. <gasps> okay. Alright, beauty oh, is pain. Oh, God, baby. Oh, you have to be beautiful. Are. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, let's get some glamour shots now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my. Well, I am completely obsessed with my look. I know, me too. Thank you so much. Uh, but yeah. if you guys also want to recreate a look, uh, you should tag us on yes. Instagram or Twitter. What's your handle? Do it. My handle is at Victoria Justice. Okay. It's very complicated. I yeah. don't know if you remember. So, uh, yeah, it's so complicated. <laughs> um, and just hashtag Rocky Horror. And when does the movie come out? October 20th. Wait, so since I'm like your friend, do I get to watch it before? <gasps> no. 
Oh, okay. I guess I'll just have to <laughs> wait. You gotta wait like the rest of them. Okay, fine. <laughs> Alright, well I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and go check out Victoria. I will link her down below. And uh, yeah, that's it for today. See you all next time. Bye. Good damn bye! <laughs> she has don't wait tattooed on her arm. Well, that was a lot of fun. That was really cool. Uh, she did a pretty good job, actually, yeah. She did a pretty good job. I can't wait to see that. It's gonna be amazing. That the, the people that they have for the live version, I can't believe it. Like, some very, very talented people are gonna be in that, and I am really looking forward to it. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up, and if you haven't already, please subscribe, and I will see you next time. Thanks.